All right, guys, this is Michael, a.k.a. The Husband. Um, just wanted to give you guys an update. Um, it is almost that time to start putting these sweet potato slips into the ground. I usually do that around my birthday. My birthday is June 15th, so right around that time is when I start planting apologize for the squinting the sun is blaring right in my eyes um but anyway um yeah man this is we're doing pretty good so far with the slips this is all from potatoes that i grew last season um so these are no you know i didn't buy these slips so i must say it turned out pretty well so these are the sweet potatoes that I had from last year that I'm now growing my slips from. As you can see, they're doing pretty good. I have no complaints. This one over here, there's only one potato in there and this thing has really been going nuts. So I anticipate another good harvest this season. I think we're gonna do pretty good. Um, I have no reason to think otherwise. So, looking real nice over here. I am battling the sweet potato weevils, I think they're called. Um, I'm going to try some diatomaceous earth. This is not where the actual slips are being planted, you know. Um, but this is just where I get them growing. I have them sitting on these rocks over here. Um, yeah, I'm going to be doing them in the exact same area I did the sweet potatoes last season. Um, I am trying to figure out how to get rid of these sweet potato weevils. I'm going to try some diatomaceous earth mixed in with the soil. Um, but anybody that has any suggestions, feel free to leave it in the comments. Also, I'm going to be doing some more research. Uh, myself just to kind of figure out what things I can do I don't do anything chemical based you know I try to do everything organically so anything that has to do with spraying some kind of pesticide anything like that that's not happening we don't do that over here um but yeah man I'm looking forward to the harvest this season um we're gonna have to I'm gonna be adding some more uh, soil to mix in with this to kind of fill these up and getting some more straw to put across the top like I did last year. I'm really not changing too much up um, if anything. My only thing is just trying to combat these sweet potato weevils. I don't want to lose a lot of potatoes to it but at the same time you know that kind of comes with the with the territory when you're dealing with doing everything naturally. Um, my two youngest ones have been helping out over here, Isaac and Aviva, pulling weeds and everything. So it kind of turned into a project that we're doing together. So this is not just my sweet potatoes. This is obviously for our whole family, but the two younger ones, you know, are helping me out a lot. And yeah, man, we're, we're looking forward. I'm going to start doing regular updates as much as I can with what we're doing over here. And just kind of letting you guys see the process. And keep in mind, um, I'm new I'm new to this. You know, I've, I've, this is probably the first season I've done. But last season was the first season where I got a real harvest, right? I dealt with some pests where my slips kept dying the season prior to that. But last season was awesome. I was very happy with the, you know, what we got. So I'm definitely going to be putting up new videos um, on this channel. I'm gonna try to do once a week, you know, to mix in with the content that my wife is already putting up just so you guys can kind of get an update of what's going on here and anybody that has experience with sweet potatoes please by all means leave comments let me know you know something i can improve uh improve on and especially when you're talking about the sweet potato people there's something that you know 
you have a tip on, I would greatly appreciate it. Like I said, I'm going to do some more research myself. Um, but yeah, man, you know, another season, uh, more sweet potatoes. Let's go.